How are you doing? I'm Malcolm Washington, director of the piano lesson. Welcome to the Mill Valley Film Festival. Thank you, thank you. How exciting has it been for you knowing this is your directorial debut and this is, has a lot of eyeballs on it already, but for you to choose this and just dive right in to hit it. <laughs> you know, I, um, I always wanted to make movies that people watched first and foremost and make movies that I felt like could stand the test of time and that inspired me because when you make a movie you give so much of yourself to it you give so much of your time to it mm -hmm. you want to make that experience worthwhile um, and when I started engaging in this material I was like okay this is a worthwhile experience this is going to be an, an adventure that I'll remember the rest of my life and talking about experiences to work alongside family and mm. just such an amazing cast mm. can you talk about what that's been like for you it's just a dream you know I think that your collaborators make so much uh, of an impression on, on the experience and I had some of the greatest collaborators in the world, the most talented people I know, come together and rally together um, behind an idea that was bigger than ourselves. And anytime you're marching in the same direction with people that you admire like that, it's just you're going to make something great. Um, so I'm so grateful that my family was with me, my cast, we became family, the crew, um, all the artisans that, whose hands have touched this. You're going to see a movie that is so personal to me and to so many people around me whose stories span space and time are all woven into this thing um, and it represents so much of a, uh, of a community and I'm so blessed with that idea. And we talk about it being generational from, mm. from the original play to mm -hmm. television and now you bringing it again to film. Can we talk about how this still is going to connect no matter what? Mm to everybody. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I think that it's important to take stock of your lineage sometimes and, and understand the sacrifices that the people before you made for you to stand in the position that you're in right now and the, and the decisions that they made that made your life possible. So I think uh, taking stock of that, having appreciation for it, even in the tough times when you don't always feel connected to maybe your family or, or to your ancestors, to remember that somebody fought for you to, to live the life that you're living now. Tell your mama to tell you about that piano. Oh, uh, Ask her how them pictures got on there. And like in the story, the heirloom of having something to pass down mm -hmm. or just maybe what you want the audience to take away to be. Is there something that you have for maybe your family? You know, in the movie, it's, it's personified in the piano, mm -hmm. but in my family, it's story. It's the idea of story. You know, I come from an oral culture and, and where stories pass down and, and you know who you are because of who came before you. Um, so the thing that I'm going to pass down to my kids is the story, the legends of the ancestors of, that came before me. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it.